Hello, uh, my name is Yoni Gutman. I'm in the Shiba Nerds as well. I hear a lot of good stories out here. I want to share a story with you. The story is a very true story. It's brought down somewhere. I don't know exactly where, but it's a very true story. It's about a huge Kabbalist, and uh, pretty much the story goes as follows. There was once a uh, there was once a boy, and he had a lot of nisainus and a lot of kaparas all day. He had kaparas and nisainus. <laughs> And he, he didn't know what to do with himself. All day he's stagging Tyra and, and constantly bad stuff are happening to him. Constantly uh, bad things are happening to him. And Tachel says he went to this Kabbalist and he tells the Kabbalist like this, I, I don't know what to do. Constantly bad stuff are happening to me. What should I do? And the Kabbalist tells him it's the sinus, it's Kaparas, it's all good, it's all for the best. Everything's going to work out. It's meant to be, it's meant to be, this and that. And the guy's nudging him, he's like, no, you don't understand, I serve Hashem, I try, I can't, this can't happen to me. And he says, don't worry, it's all going to work out. And he's nudging him and nudging him, he's like, okay, fine, I'm going to try something on you. And he puts him in a, a trance, he makes him fall asleep. And he falls asleep in his trance, and he has a dream. And while he's dreaming, his dream goes as follows. He was walking on a road, and it's one straight path, and he's walking on the road, and a gorgeous wagon passes by him, gorgeous blue white horse, gorgeous stallion white horse, gorgeous basket, gorgeous driver with a perfect hat, everything looked perfect and gorgeous. And he asked the guy, can I have a ride? Can you give me a ride down the road? And he said, no, keep walking, keep walking. And the stallion drove away, the horse drove away. And he's walking, he's walking, a couple of minutes later, a nasty, dirty donkey pulls up to him, and it's dirty, and it's nasty, and it's broken, the wheels are falling off, everything's falling apart, and, uh, and he, he tells the guy, can I have a ride down the road? Can you, can you help me out? And he says, no, keep walking, keep walking, walk down the road, eventually you get there. And he drives away. And finally, the guy work, walks, and after a couple minutes of walking, he sees these two wagons sitting right next to each other. The white wagon and, and the dirty wagon. And, I, and these two wagon drivers were Malachim. And the Malachim take the wagons, and they say, this is all your mitzvahs, and this is all your averas. And he's putting on all the averas, and he puts on all the mitzvahs, and they weigh it out on a scale. And uh, the dirty wagons winning the winning the mitzvahs. He's winning the the, the Averis are winning. There's more Averis than mitzvahs. And then a wagon pulls up with all his kaparas and all his nisaynis and all his all his uh, problems that Hashem put him to to help him out in the world for kaparas. And this wagon comes and they go all on his mitzvah side. And the, the wagon it's it's leveling out and it's it's coming to a point and it's about to and it's pretty much even and the guy in his dream he's screaming I more kaparas more nasinus more nasinus more nasinus and he wakes up from his from his trance and he's sitting there with the rabbi and he's saying the rabbi says to him he's like wow when you came to me before you said you didn't want nasinus you didn't want kaparas and now when you wake up you're screaming more nasinus more kaparas so, the story, what I'm trying to say is you never know, you never know. You never know what things happen for you, you never know what's going to happen, you never know why things happen, but everything happens for a reason, and, uh, and that's pretty much it. I wish you all the best in your endeavors, and everything will happen for the best.